Hello fellow RuneScape games and welcome to the new Polypore Dungeon, um, I guess, first look. And this is the Polypore Staff, if you just saw it there. Um, I don't know if you can tell, but uh, normally when you hit somebody, it's it's red damage, but this Polypore Staff here, this guy has, it hits purple. And So he's going to attack with it here, and as you see, it's purple. And one of the great things about the Polypore Staff is that you don't need any runes to use it. You don't have to have any runes in your inventory, and uh, it'll still attack it. So as this person with the Polypore Staff just told me, it's 4.5 mil right now, and it's it degrades, like many Darox things. So I'm going to visit the Polypore Dungeon right now. And the quickest way to do this is by rubbing a do arena and uh, go to the... Ocar Duel Arena. Sorry, I think kind of handy there. It's an uncommon drop, he said. I have the Ring of Wealth, so we'll see how that works, but I believe it said something about walking from the bank. So I'll just pause it here, and when I get there, or when I get to the bank, I'll show you. So continue to go over here, and uh, open the gate to the Mag Training Arena. Now, I believe you can go behind here. I'm not quite sure. I believe you just go this way. Yeah, this looks like, this looks like it should be right. Go through this little passage here. I think it's just right about where the X is there. Yeah. An agility shortcut, it said too, and a uh, dungeoneering shortcut. And the great thing about this dungeon, by the way, is uh, you don't need any skill requirements. It's better to have. Um, it's much better to have a. Frick, uh, what is it called? Magic, high magic level though. You can teleport Fairy Ring, I believe. It says on the main page in the news right now. I believe it's B I D. Whoa. Okay, this is pretty crazy. Definitely new looking. Oh, shot right off the bat. What does he got here? Ooh, poncho visor web. Do I need that? Will I die if I don't have it? Basic flakes may be sewn. Oh yeah, it was saying something about flakes in the new update. What level are those? Fungal rodent. So only level nine. So I don't know if I need a uh, any kind of slayer level to attack them. Nope. Works. Creature infests you with toxic fungus. Uh oh, that's not good. Okay, so they're doing poison damage. So. I don't know if that'll hit more or what, but I think you should prob once you if you're attacking higher level guy. Oh, that's a new item. If you're attacking higher level guys, I'm guessing you want to have protect or uh melee prey on. Let's see what this is. Neem droop. What is this? Is this tradable? This item isn't tradable. What happens if I squish one? Squish. We need an un oh, so it's something. All right. Let's see how much runes they drop here. Let's attack another one while we're at it. Three, so not very many. So worth keeping. I'm not hitting very high on these guys. I'm only using adamant bolts too, but still. What are these guys, same thing. Limport, green charge, more of this neem droop. I'm gonna keep this stuff and see what it does when you squish it. I don't know if I need a level for that or what. So this is the same stuff. Fungal rodents. Oh, here we go. Whoa, fungal mage level 120. Right. Let's try these guys. Wonder if we'll still attack me with mage prey. Nope, doesn't seem to. But it does seem to have a lot of health. Holy crap. I didn't bring any prayer pots. I'm really just, I'm not hitting very high on these guys. Honestly, I'm using rapid, but still, it's not hitting very high. It's out of bolts. Usually they can hit up to like 200 and just kind of thing. I think it has something to do with maybe magic will do more damage. Let's see this guy was maging over here. Is he doing any more damage? 
I'm just gonna see. So this guy's using mage. I'm just gonna kind of check if he does more damage while I'm just creeping over here. Let's see. So yeah, I believe my prey is going to run out before I finish this guy off, obviously, because they're obviously not immune, or they are immune to range. How long can you tag me for? So right here this is a, uh, one of these hidden dungeoneering things. Oh, it's a very high one. Wow. I only have 49 dungeoneering, and that's a lot. Oh, what is that? Infested axe. All right, let's try this then. Can I attack that? I'm already under. Oh, that guy still remembered me. How really? These guys have a really high fire rate. His mages. I walk over here. Will this guy attack me? I don't think it said they. I think it said they weren't aggressive, so they don't attack you by themselves. Pretty sure that's what it said. That guy still remembers me, as you can see. Yeah, they have a super high fire rate. They don't seem to be hitting very high though. And wow, how is he still attacking me from over there? I don't think they can teleport or anything, can they? Anyway, let's attack one of these stupid axes. Can't seem to there we go. Okay, now let's see how this goes. So what do they hit with? They hit with. Come on, hit me! Just did. Didn't pay attention though. So obviously range is not what you want to use. I believe you just want to start using mage when you get in here. Yeah, I don't know. So far, there's been these fungal rodents, those creepy whatever guys, these fungal mage dudes. This infested axe thing. Nothing else so far, but I'm gonna keep going because this is a big dungeon. I saw it on a. I looked on the world map, it's pretty big. The way you hit nothing with a uh, range kind of makes me seem that you want to be using or it makes you use magic. So, what did it drop here? Oh, leg spike! Big leg spike! Holy crap! Sorry for that. Potato cactus. Oh, that's pretty really much, is it? Oh, whatever. I'll keep it. Let's go over here. See how good uh see how good Mew is. Thank you. Nope, so it's just as shitty. See that RuneScape just tried to tell me that a twenty-two is my highest. Not a two hundred twenty, a twenty-two. So yeah. Oh there we go, fungal flake. Okay, this is the other thing it said in the update. It's fungal flakes. So when you get that from that merchant you can buy clothes. Those um you can put these flakes on it and I think it increases it or so I'm not sure what it does, but I'm not sure if it increases your damage or what. And I believe at the very beginning you can go down a ladder and it'll let you um it'll let you access other monsters and stuff. I'm not sure if this whole dungeon is just these kind of monsters or what, but uh let's see. Oh there's a new one. Griflaro. It's level 180. A bit harder. I'm just gonna see what else there is before I attack one. And I'm gonna get some magic gear before I start attacking them. Next. I'll come back later with some magic stuff. I'm not really sure what all these fungus things do either. Kind of confusing. Here we go. So 
Let me give me a same fungal earnings. Okay, so climb down vine. Let's see what this does. Any new monsters? Nope. Let's go this way. Oh, is that new? No, that roof Yep. So I'm not quite sure what the purpose of this dungeon. It might be just for magic XP, I'm not sure. Oh, here we go. Here's a new mon oh no, same guys, but uh yeah, as you can see he's using magic and it works good for him, so I'm up to oh you can climb down the vine once more, so I'll just try that. Whoa, everything's purple now. Oh, here's a new Whoa, holy crap. One forty stolen things. Jeez. So what is that? Anyway, it's a very organic dungeon as you can see, everything's really weird. Okay, there's another new thing. Level 200, Griffalapine is the highest level monster so far. Level 200. Seems to be a melee monster. I'm not sure about that, though. And there's got to be a key to something. I know there's going to be something with this fungal growth stuff. Maybe it's for crafting, dungeoneering, herb lore. I'm not sure. Something. Oh, oh that's back here. What's going on over here? On the floor, just bones, just bones. Tea tagging. All right, so this has been a uh, first look at the new dungeon, the uh, polypore dungeon, and the new item, the polypore staff. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll be doing a kind of a guide that'll tell you what kind of spells etc to use in a bit. Alright, see ya.